there, Mid-Century Modern Airs. It's Adrian Kinney here, coming to you from Lakewood, Colorado. Again, my hometown where I grew up. I am at 2290 Car Street, which is an absolutely remarkable one-owner home that's going to be coming onto the market. This home has three bedrooms, two baths, and an additional two bedrooms downstairs non-conforming. Upstairs, we've got 1479 square feet, and in the basement, another full 1479 square feet. This home is absolutely remarkable, especially with the attention to detail, and I cannot wait to show you it now. So come on with me and let's go check it out. Here I am in the main living space of this architect design home. Robert Braun was the architect of this home, built it for he and his family, and he and his wife actually lived here their entire life. Now the kids have inherited the property and ready to look for the next owner of this absolutely amazing piece of architecture. Robert Braun, the architect of this home, under the GI Bill, attended the Illinois Institute of Technology. There he was in the architecture program, and at the time, the architecture program was looked over by none other than Mies van der Rohe. Those of you that are in the modernism community know Mies van der Rohe was a figurehead in it that really influenced a lot of the modernism ideas that we see today. Well, when Mr. Braun graduated and came here to Colorado, he decided obviously I need to have my own practice. And at the time, he didn't really want to have an office, but wanted to have a home office. So how do you combine the private residence with the home office? He came up with a pretty ingenious idea to put the two together. And let me show you how he did it. He had two massive moving walls here in the private residence in Lakewood, Colorado. So as the clients came to their house, he was able to close off a section of it, talk to the clients, and then open it back up. So it was a living, working office and private residence. Pretty remarkable, and they work pretty dang well after 60 years. All right, here we are now in the kitchen of this immaculate time capsule of a house. And as you can see, it is so well preserved. The cabinets that are in these homes, they're actually original, hand-built craftsperson's cabinets. All these houses had somebody usually on site doing a lot of the woodwork, and this is a testament to that. They are old, they look new, they were quality materials at the time. Put a little elbow grease in like these homeowners did, and they are back to how they were when they were originally put in. That's why I love them so much. If you were trying to rebuild these today, they'd be a pretty big price tag as they'd be full-on custom cabinet work. So, Always a great thing to keep if you can. Easy to change out the hardware, make them function a little more like today's cabinets do, but always just a great testament to the craftsmanship of the era. Here we are on the main floor bathroom. As most of you know, I'm a sucker for an original bathroom and this one is in immaculate shape. You've still got the original salmon pink sinks, original countertops, and original built-in sliding medicine cabinets, as well, the yellow divider behind me, love it. And as most of you know, the kind of mustardish range of colors is back in trend right now. So as this is a great inspiration piece for those of you that are trying to do a retrovation, even has cork floors, which some of you know I put into one of my recent Cliff May rehabs. So this is a great one just to check out to get that inspiration. You know, I love the original bathrooms. Here I am in the basement of this remarkable home, and as most of you know, most of these mid-century modern homes don't actually have basements. 
This one is actually a full basement at another 1479 square feet, which just adds, especially like we talked about, folks are home more often now, so it gives you the extra space that you may be needing. As well, there's the second bathroom and two additional non-conforming bedrooms down here. All right, Mid-Century Modern Airs, thank you so much for joining me on the tour of this absolutely remarkable home here in Lakewood, Colorado. Again, I'm at 2290 Carr Street. This three bedroom, two bath, plus two non-conforming bedrooms in the basement is 1479 square feet on the main floor and 1479 square feet below grade. This home is absolutely remarkable and I cannot wait for you all to come through and check out what this home is like in person as the amount of detail here is absolutely remarkable. As always, I have the honor and privilege of showcasing these homes to you all and bringing them in the best light possible. And not just saying we need to scrape it or paint everything white. There's a lot of great detail here that can be kept polished up and showcased. Thank you so much for stopping by again, Mid-Century Modern Airs, and have a great day. So